I'm not sending my son outside to town watch without being strapped at this point. No disrespect, but that's where it's coming to. President, residents rather, pack the first police district in South Philadelphia tonight to express their concerns about crime in their neighborhood. Good evening, everyone. I'm Jessica Cartaglia. And I'm Yuki Washington. Those residents made sure their voices were heard tonight. Eyewitness News reporter Greg Argos details the issues concerned citizens brought up this evening. I can't walk across the street by myself without being in fear of now it's guns. Yeah. This group of concerned neighbors in South Philadelphia. It's not knives. I could take a beating. Perhaps representing how many people feel throughout the city with the uptick in violent crimes plaguing Philly. We're able to take him and another individual in custody. Those who live within the police department's first district gathering to speak with the captain and community officers who patrol their streets. This meeting, the first since a disturbing discovery last week. Week, where investigators uncovered the remains of 18 year old Aaron Schweikert in a basement on the 2100 block of Porter Street. This neighbor saying he often witnessed drug transactions taking place outside of that home. I have watched six drug deals a day. What's the threshold for calling 911? I, I feel like an idiot calling for drug dealing. His question is, what's the threshold for calling 911? Our response to that is, call 911. If your gut tells you there's something wrong, share that information with us. Because if your gut's telling you there's something wrong, there's probably something wrong. The city reeling from 29 homicides this year alone, according to the Philadelphia Police website. That's an 81% increase from this date in 2019. Officers at Tuesday night's meeting addressing the Schweikert investigation, but also offering suggestions on how to prevent other nonviolent crimes, like package and other property thefts. In terms of target hardening, uh, is exterior lighting outside of your house, Exterior video cameras, those things deter these criminals and they're routinely caught. Greg Argos, CBS 3 Eyewitness News.